Hey, son. Do you work here? Possibly. Why? I'm looking for mustard. My son likes mustard. <laughs> you know what you- Hey! You need to watch her. She finna steal something. So my name is Kari Kenshin. Been a boy on a mission. Don't understand in detention. Noah. Huh? Hello! Hello and welcome! Welcome! To the Cory Kitch Stop, stop. You guys. Uh see these guys welcome to the Corey Kenshin channel where videos are inconsistent but well put together kick your feet up grab a snack and welcome today we're gonna welcome gonna be playing fierce to fathom chapter three welcome Carson house welcome sup what's going on Corey Kenshin here and welcome to fierce to fathom Carson house I have been waiting for a hot Minute. I told y'all this was gonna be the first game that we played in the new year, and then I dropped three sponsor videos back to back. Please! No! But from the wise words of the great Cash Nasty, I got bills to pay. No true words have been spoken. Cup! Time to pay some bills! Did I plan to do that? No. But I also didn't plan to do the thing that I still can't talk to you guys about. And I'm gonna keep on breaking that up. But anyways, Fears to Fathom. We played the first episode. How do you room? Ain't nobody here. What's good? What's good? <laughs> chapter two dropped. I must have been on a break because we never did chapter two. And now I'm doing chapter three. Wow. So in typical Corey fashion, I'm probably the only YouTuber <laughs> that's gonna have chapter three, but not chapter two. But I wanna play chapter three. Now, if you're new here, Samurai slice that like button, but I also meant new to the game. See, Fierce to Fathom is a episodic series where people submit true stories and the game dev makes a horror game out of it. So let's see what number three is about. We just bought the new game it up. <laughs> yes, sir. September 24th. My name is Noah. I'm a 28 year old, 28 year old male from the, my name is Noah. I'm a 28, I have no idea why I'm sending this, but I hope my story can be a lesson. This happened to me when I was 18. But I remember this incident like yesterday as the trauma dictated a major part of my life. I'm on my narration tip right now. For a little background, my dad was a realtor and almost always became friends with his clients. One day, he came home and pitched me a small job offer for the weekend. One of his old clients was going away for a few days and needed somebody he could trust to watch over his house. The man worked as a COO at a local media company. Dad told me the man would pay me $100 just to watch the house and do some basic chores. I accepted the offer as I had nothing interesting going on for the weekend. Besides, I thought I could use the time to get my schoolwork done. My dad drove me to the house. So, we seem to be in a laundromat. Up, down, up, down. I know y'all know what time it is. Uh, yeah, being in a laundromat by yourself at night, no thanks. How about that? Uh, why would I do that? I don't work here. Can I go outside? No. Okay. All right, we're just going to go down here then for some reason. Hold up. Look at this board real quick. Next game, we did a little Cory Kenshin, like, you know, a little Easter egg. I mean, why not, you know? Employees only. All right. Go down here. I'm having a nightmare, because what the freak is that? Abyss over there? I'll... Who is this? Yo. Bleach. What? Excuse me? Where did you put it? Uh, who are you? Where's the bleach? I need bleach. What even is this place? Who are you? 
<laughs> yeah. I said I need bleach! Noah? Noah! Noah. Nap time's over. over. We're here. We're here. You said you could do this. Wake up now. Wake up, Noah. Noah, wake up. Noah, wake up. You still think you can do this? Uh, oh, that's the music. How long did I doze off for? Doesn't matter. Can you do this now? I got this. Roy called and said the key should be under the fake rock. Got it. He said it's in the backyard. And like I said, keep the doors locked and don't open the door for anyone. I heard you the first time, Dad. Okay, I get your juice up and get to work. I hope you know I'm only doing it for the snacks. Alright. Alright, Dad, but wait, before we leave before you leave, let me talk to you real quick. Dad! Dad! What? It's about to say I left the garage door open. Guess we finna get robbed. All right, it was a nice neighborhood. Yeah, it looks nice enough. I don't like when people drive by though. I know y'all saw the beginning of Get Out. Traumatize me. Okay. Had to get the key from the backyard. Already can't follow instructions. Ominous, malicious sounding aura. What is playing in my ears? I got the math notebook. Uh, they said it was a rock in the backyard. Hold up, they got a dog? I don't do animals. <laughs> Wait, can I pet him? All right, good. I'm gonna name you Sparky. Oh, the water's in the pool? Oh, no. I got a little wet. <laughs> uh, not the first time I heard that. Where's that rock at, by the way? I'm out here. Wait, can I? Wait, what? Message is Evelyn Cooper. Hold up, this is my girl? Let me call you in a bit. Wish you could come tonight. Me too. Things you do to keep your old man happy. You know I haven't been a good kid to him. If your dad doesn't think you're a good kid, I don't know what mine thinks. Just think I'm really disappointed with Kara. Not again, being yourself. You can feel so stupid. Making up the grudge. Wink, wink. By the way, I miss, I miss you. you. Nah, fellas, listen. I told you this before. Y'all can say I got W Riz. Sometimes, just leave your girl a note. Well, I don't know if this is my girl or not, but I'm about to lay down some breadcrumbs. Just throw a random I miss you out there. Let's see what she say. Oh, hell no. Where's the rock at? Oh, here we go. Fake rock key. All right, let's get to the front. Or can I go? Oh, nice. All right, first of all, no curtains. Big mistake. Big mistake. Can I lock the door? No! Okay. Do not disturb for any reason. I had to pee. Okay. We got a little YouTuber or what? Nice little setup right here. Nothing crazy. Some of y'all suckers think you gotta get a XL49000 setup. Oh, you got a little laptop? green screen all of that off amazon but where's the bathroom i realized the house was way bigger than ours here we go goodness oh uh dang suck a drink three gatorades <laughs> wash your nasty freaking hands wait what did I pick up? Hold up. Let me read this message. Thanks for taking up the job, kid. I really appreciate you doing this. I'm sorry I had to leave early. Mr. Carson? Oh, so that, that was like an auto text back. Okay. My bad. It's Roy. Got this contact from Walter. Work is really getting the best of me here. Oh, so he got an iPhone. Oh, no problem, Mr. Carson. My pleasure, really. <laughs> He's my dad. Um, I'm trying to wash my hands though. Let me take a little survey of outside. Okay. Roy Carson. I wouldn't have asked for anyone if it wasn't for Zeke. Zeke? Boy's been a little sick lately. 
Oh, I'll take care of him in the house now that I'm here. Yeah, nothing to worry about, Mr. Carson. Okay, so I'm guessing that's the dog. I'm just trying to wash my hands, like... Do we not do that anymore? Bro! Stop texting me! You're a lifesaver, kid. Speaking of him, I wanted to remind you it's his dinner time. If you could get him his dog food from the basement, right on it. Okay. Say less. Light over the shower. Nice. Until you splash some water on it and freaking get electrocuted. We about to be s sitting in this house. The smartest thing we can do is learn where everything is at. So let's go in the basement. Get our old boy Zeke some dog food. That's going to be down here. The basement was a little too dark. So what? We got to get a flashlight? Okay. Almost forgot. I apologize for those lights in the basement. You could grab the flashlight in the storage room upstairs. Go. Oh. Is this the storage room? This looks like a storage room. Bro. Why is there no light in the storage room? Dog food. Dog food. Oh, this is it? Nice. Yo, Zeke. Got your grub, my boy. Had to open again. I'm going for realism, huh, game dev? Is this a can opener? Now, Zeke, got your grub, my boy. Go ahead and handle this. Uh huh. You know you like them, uh, them beef, beef cutlets. Handle that. Yeah, eat up. I'm gonna eat that too. All right. Um, let's get back in the house. I do not like being outside. Hey, kid. Heard from Walter you're a computer whiz, huh? I have a favor to ask. My computer has been acting weird lately, and my whole security system is tied to it. Oh yeah, you got a whole security system set up here? I feel the safest upstairs. I have a lot of expensive equipment laying around. Don't want anything happening to it. Yeah, I understand. I'll just take a look at your computer. Thanks, kid. Bro. I'm 18, bro. <laughs> Put some respect on my name. Oh, wait, no, this is a TV. No, not, uh not happening. Mr. Carson's bedroom had this weird smell of wet clothes. Oh, here's Serial Killer. How'd I make that deduction? Trust me, that's how. <laughs> Skin color, need I say more? Now, yeah, these look like uh, Serial Killer shirts for sure. Look like cleaning materials to clean up. <laughs> Looks like cleaning materials to clean up. What? <laughs> All right, very astute there, Corey. All right, cool. Finally, Mr. Carson's office looked like a good spot I could sit down to work at. Oh, what does he do? Broadcast alien transmissions? I remember I was doing calculus that night. Reintegrating zero to infinity. What kind of calculus? I did have schoolwork to do, but I wasn't feeling it at the time. <gasps> I forgot the password. <laughs> yeah, I did. Uh, Alec Carson, fifty-three eighty-seven. All right, I got this, guys. And it's not gonna show us. All right, hold up. A L E. Was the C capital? No. Carson, fifty. 387? <laughs> hey, <laughs> that's what I do. Egg.exe, we gotta click on that immediately. Wait, what? All right, I guess we'll come back to that. Flat, guess the flat. Guy to being a what? Oh yeah, you know we going all in. I wanna know what he doing on here. Being a better person? Oh no! <laughs> oh no! Uh uh. That's strike two, Mr. Carson. You got a weird smell coming out of your bedroom. Then you got an MP4 in your cycle bin called Guide to Being a Better Person. What are you feeling guilty about, huh, Roy? Hey, hey, hey. 
so much. Wait. Alec Carson? That's not the name of the guy's house we're watching, is it? Wow, and it actually stays up on the computer. I like it. It's Roy. Uh, here we go. Listen. So my name is Corey Kenshin. Been a boy on a mission. Don't understand in detention. Uh, feel free to take a break when needed. Progress will not be impeded. Step one, don't be rude. That's kind of rude. That's kind of crude. Who is this dude? Uh. <laughs> rude. Oh, yeah. Nah, something wrong with the broadcast. What you mean? In the meantime, enjoy some happy images. Uh, uh, uh. That's a dog. What's about to happen? I don't. Yeah. All right. Step two. Remain calm in any conversation. What is this? Hello. Is this Spooky Scary Sunday? What are we watching? Now, even though what he said was controversial, did you say calm? The secret to being calm is to not let your feelings interfere with the conversation. Being calm makes you a better person. All right, well, some situations don't call for being calm, like this one. All right, hold up, hold up. Press pause. This is important. I don't know who these people are. Okay, well, uh, clearly something's going on with the Carson residence. We're going to put this back in the recycle bin. Wait, can I... I gotta put this back, or they're gonna know that I did this. Uh, it's not letting me drag it back, so that's not good. Um, internet browser. Oh yeah, we about to see what he been doing. Free trial for limited. All right, so this is obviously a scam virus. You know, old people, they don't know, they just click on things. Uh, let's go to peak internet. Well, now you're just a hater. Okay, so nothing works. The only thing we can do is click on this. Antivirus96.com. I mean, this isn't sponsored, but I always recommend Trend Micro. Um, I've never, they never steered me wrong. I, I don't know about y'all. I never heard of Antivirus96. It really doesn't sound reputable in my opinion, but um, I guess <laughs> this is what we got to do. Uh, let's see, benefits. Uh, Live 24-7 threat monitoring. Okay, okay. I mean, it sounds great, but I don't have a credit card to... Free download? I don't know about y'all. I never heard of nothing free being trustworthy. Welcome to Antivirus 96. Virus definition up to date. All right, doesn't really make sense. Full scan. Just got some free antivirus that is literally uploading viruses into every file in this man's computer. I, this is a very irresponsible thing to do, and I would strongly recommend that you never do anything like this. All right, threats found, three. Okay, we got a Trojan, all right, remove. All threats removed. You're protected. So, I mean, did that fix everything? The program can't start because it's missing from your computer. That sucks. I wanted to see egg, egg, exe. Roy Carson. Got a text message. Hold on, let me see. Tell that to my kid. Wait, what? Oh, it's done. It was just some Trojan. I'd recommend you only download softwares from trusted sites. Tell that to my kid. That's who Alec is. But thanks. I'll drop you a nice tip when I get back. All right, now Evelyn's text me. Just had the weirdest dream ever. Ooh, what was it about? Weird. Reminds me of Cooking with Jeffrey on Channel 10 last night. By the way, the rerun must be on right now, so you gotta watch it with me. Wait, that place got a TV? <laughs> yeah, hold on. Okay, before that, I'm not I'm not ready to watch TV yet. Oh, I can get on the camera now. Alright, before we do that, can I do any Y'all thought I didn't notice? Come on now. This easy freaking question. 
I was just playing. Let me get the next one. Ooh, if I didn't know this one, I'm getting flamed in the comments. All right, next one. I don't know about y'all, but I know Maldives when I... <clears throat> oh, this one? Come on now. Brazil? Hags, no. That was always Palau. Come on now. Get out of here. Oh, shout out to Malaysia. Country is this? See, you can tell with the star. Oh, see, look. That was always this one. Come on now. Country is this flag? See, this just screams St. Lucia. All right, I know Bosnia when I see it. All right, I'm not, I'm not sure about y'all. And this one? It's a country called Chad? No way. But I know Brunei. It was Chad's flag? Hey, shout out to Libya. Bro, whose flag is this? It's what you're saying right now. I know this is Hugo Slop. Bro, what flag is this? Bro, they making up flags now. That's what I would say if I didn't know this was honestly one of the easiest flags of all time. Give me Swaziland. Let's check on this INET 7. He got cameras everywhere. So he's about to see me going through his stuff. That dog's still eating dang. Okay. I mean. Oh, yeah, I like that. Nothing seems to be a miss. But y'all know that's temporary. Oh, boy. All right, let's get up. All right, so uh, we're going to go watch TV now. And yes, I'm keeping this flashlight in my hands. Wait. Was this light on? I don't remember these lights being on. Uh, I can't. I can't spook myself. Uh, let's. What was that? Jeffrey, and today we are cooking cat food. Oh no, I this is Spooky Scary Sunday. <laughs> are you it's watching my cat food? Favorite dish. It's super enjoyable Ooh. and healthy. It's my favorite dish. Doesn't that just look delicious? No! You can't eat this, it's raw. So first, we are going to gently pour the cat food onto this conveniently placed pan. I will be preparing what's known as a piece of cardboard dipped in milk. What? <laughs> we will need a piece of cardboard, a glass, and some milk. Yo, I don't want to watch this again. To start, we poured the milk into the glass. Uh-huh. Bro. There's the a YouTuber that makes videos just like this. Also, I think you should get the groceries before it gets that. too dark outside. There's some cash in my nightstand. Is finished cooking. We can finally serve it. That was Berlizzi! What? <laughs> I heard it like in the last few words. I heard it. Hello, I'm the hand merchant. Buy some hands. All right, all right. We're going to the store? That's part of this job? I hate these ads. I'm sorry, Eve, I gotta run. This dude's on my butt right now, wants me to get groceries in the middle of the night. There's some cash in the nightstand. Wait, how long am I staying here? Ranch, eggs? No, but you're missing the best part. All right, well, I'm still here. Let me see what the best part is. Bro, we, you still watching hands? That's the best part for you? Nightstand, gotta be here. For your trouble, get something for yourself as well. It's on the house. Thank you. Well, I hope there's enough cash here to... You can take Alex's bike. It's outside the garage. What's up with this music? Goodness. All right, there it is. I get to ride the bike? Which way's the store? 
Hold up, get off, get off. Oh, this is heat. Let's just get on the bike. Let's just get on the bike. Alright. Be sure not to get lost. Wait, first of all, what does the house even look like? Alright, this is the house, y'all. Don't forget. Hopefully, the store is this way. Am I? Nine twenty-two p.m. Oh, nice. Okay. We going to Nux? We going to Nux? No! There are other reasons I could have died that night. <laughs> All right. I'm at the store. Yo. What's good, bruh? I'm just here to do some shopping. Do you play football or something? Hey, them Choco Pops look like they hitting. Oh, we're all feeling kind of alive. I like that. All right. Let me, uh, strange dreams. Yeah, actually. The Willamette Valley Dream Survey is investigating a recent spike in bizarre, unexplainable dreams. Well, I'm at, huh? Dead rising. Hey, she just happened to text me when I got her number open? What up, what up? Just hit her with that? I'm telling you. Let's see what's going on with these people. Are you just looking at the dog food? Yeah, I, I, I recommend this brand highly. I gave it to my, uh, my dog, Zeke. He got some large hands there. Um... Uh, all right, I wasn't done talking, but. Yo, fellas. And speak of the devil. Turner and Andy? Bro, your girl was here. She just left. What do you mean by that? Eve? What was her name? Kara or something? Dude, I said they're not dating anymore. Oh yeah, he hopped to that other chick so quick, I didn't even realize. Don't listen to him. But dude, she bought tons and tons of cans. I think she's throwing like a party or something. You know anything about it? Bro, she looks way older without the makeup. MILF energy. <laughs> Ew. I think she's more of like a goth. Goth MILF energy. Are you guys done? Anyways, dude. What are you up to tonight? Just chilling. You should come with us, dude. We're going to the movies after this. Ah, I have to house sit for this guy Carson tonight. You mean at Alex? He goes to school with my sister. Her kid's a real weirdo, especially since his parents split up. Yeah, he did make that little movie. Whatever fills my pocket, I'm in for. All right, dude. See you at school on Monday then. See you around, Andy. Back in high school, Turner was the class clown. Yo, do you know what you- Hey, you need to watch her. She finna steal something. Acting real sus. Walking around the store humming, but not picking up anything. Belly, yeah, you staring at me. I know why, too. Could at least be a little discreet about your racism. Uh, what you doing? Huh? You could actually talk to me. Hey, the humming girl behind me! Oh! She's like, hmm, <laughs> Hey, son, do you work here? Possibly, why? I'm looking for mustard. My son likes mustard. <laughs> <laughs> you know, sometimes I surprise myself with my voice acting. <clears throat> Stop, don't laugh. I'm looking for mustard. <laughs> looking for mustard. My son likes mustard, but I can't find it for the life of me. Do you know where it is? Let me get it for you, ma'am. Oh, how nice of you. I'll be right over here. All right. Like, I don't know if that was scripted. Like, I just walked up to her. But let's get this mustard, because her son likes mustard. I'm going to guess probably here. Here you go. Very well. There it is. <laughs> Thank you, son. No problem, lady. Old box booty over here just 
patrolling the store. I don't know what she's doing. All right, seminar. Let's look at this list. So we need ranch. There's a lot of stuff. Can I get a... Yeah, let me get that. So we'll get ranch. Uh, we also got strawberry jelly. Uh, it's going to be that one there. Choco spread for Alex. I, I'm going to guess it is. Milk and eggs. Milk. I'm going to take that. Get them organic ones too. Why? I don't know. Organic means healthy. I Garden peas. Where'd I say? Garden peas. Garden peas. It's kind of like we grocery shopping together. You know? I feel like I'm a fun person to grocery shop with. Like, I would definitely get some Choco Cops. Y'all know I'm throwing Swedish fish in the basket. Yo. Oh, that looked like peas. Yeah. All right. Junk was hidden. Get honey. Yep. Honey. Uh, rice. Uncle Tony's only. Should have got Uncle Ben's. Ketchup. And then something for myself. You already know. You already know what I'm getting. Them Choco Cops. And I'm listening to this song, too. Uh, listen. 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 On that Carson house, got my girl, she got her blouse. I'm about to go and buy a house. After that, it's a wrap. Uh, that didn't rhyme. I don't even know, but I got the time coming in. The rhyme sublime. C O R Y. That's my name. Don't wear it out. I'm just trying to go out to the club and meet this girl. Her name is Tanya. Now let me tell you about Tanya. Bad little chick, long dark hair. You know, I'm just trying to go there. Uh, underwear. <laughs> that looks heavy, kid. Should I bill all that for you? Mr. Carson didn't leave enough money for me to buy extra stuff. So I guess no Choco Cops for me. Just throw it on the ground there. Should I bill this for you? Yes, please. Thanks for shopping at Nux. You have a good one. All right. Spent 35 minutes getting like five things from the store. Around. Hold on, I'm about to put that bully music on. Yeah, riding a bike around the city. Yo, Rockstar, where's Bully 2? Y'all missing out on some cash, bro. That game will go crazy. Bullworth Academy? Probably gonna have to play with a different character because, um, what's the name? Grew up. 946. Is this the house? I had to pee again and I was farting, farting starting to feel a little hungry. Alright. Let's just get inside the house. Is this the house? Outside, like, that, that aura, that sound is just, that ambiance is crazy. I kept groceries in the kitchen, thought I'd get some schoolwork done. I thought you had to pee. And this pee is yellow too. This dude drink a lot of juice, a lot of Kool-Aid. Bro, you should be drinking a couple of bottles of water a day. Couple cups of water a day. That's the toilet. Still no, where's the soap at? Oh, it start raining? Okay. All right, so. What the freak? Andy Reynolds. Dude, you said you're a Carson's, right? You need to see this. Search up Roy Carson divorce on the internet right now. Oh, shoot. Roy Carson divorce. Okay. Roy Carson, co-founder of BN Media, claims to be receiving death threats from the angry fans of his ex-wife. Oh, this is the guy that I'm... That's him. It's not unusual for audience to be nosy. We see something similar with the case of Roy Carson, the COO and co-founder of BN Media after his very public breakup and divorce with his wife, former actress Alyssa Brown Carson has allegedly been receiving death threats from the fans of Alyssa for the rumored infidelity that underwent within that the said relationship. Oh no, that's where I'm... Someone was at the front door. 
Oh, it's pizza. It's pizza. Okay, is this pizza? Is this pizza? Get up, get up. I don't know who ordered pizza, but I'm about to tear into that. I'm hungry in real life, too. Hold up, hold up. I hope it's already paid for. Who is it? Your delivery for your one medium size from Pizza Depot, sir. Uh, what delivery? I didn't order any pizza. Your one medium size pepperoni pizza, sir. You must be at the wrong. Yeah, actually, I don't think we should open this. This is 224 Boulevard, right? That's correct. It's ordered by the name of... Um... Roy Carson? I would never open this, but it's a video game. I'm, I'm curious. Why is he standing to the side? Why he standing off to the side? Stand in the front. Here. Hey, this is probably a very strange request, but do you think I could wait inside until the rain's over? Oh, heck no. It's probably not very safe to be out here right now, and I forgot my raincoat at the shop. How did you get here? Uh, yeah, this is not my house. I understand you could just say no. Well, you have a good day. What? Ah, oh, heck no. He drove here and said, can you wait inside? Oh, no. Nah. Hold on. Hold on. What is in this pizza box? A bomb? Throw it down. Thought I could watch some TV while eating. No, use your brain, dude. That is not sitting right with me at all. And he trying to just sit down and watch TV? Bro, you done got me stressing out here and you ordered the pizzas? Pizza was nice and hot despite the rain. Spooks. Bro, I'm literally getting pizza after this. Get up! Get up! Jack. How are you doing your work? Shut up! I guess I'm just gonna keep eating this. Until something happens. Hope everything's okay. See, you got your girl waiting. Sorry, I got caught up with work. Good night, Eve. Sweet dreams. What? Bro, <laughs> what's the dude that makes these kind of videos? Bro, is that my? I heard someone at the door again. Hold up, hold up, throw that down. Guess what? I'm going way to freak upstairs. I knew I heard a knock at the door. I should have closed the TV. You got me messed up. You got me messed up. Go ahead and check that camera. <gasps> flowers. There was flowers. the flowers I guess also not a smart idea to open the door but who is it yeah she's left flowers I don't know what to make of it put them in the kitchen with everything else oops maybe um, Roy 
got a, a, a new girlfriend or something. I don't know. Unknown sender. Oh, boy. Hey, how are you? What'd you have for dinner? I assumed it was a wrong number. It was strange, but I dismissed the thought as a weird coincidence and moved on. Besides, I had a lot of work to catch up on. Work on that math. Thought I'd have that pizza first. Bro, you didn't eat eight slices! Alright, finish your two raggedy slices. Dang. Engrossment. Whatever that means. 1.36 AM. While I was in the middle of my schoolwork, the power went out. Five messages? Are you by yourself? Why do you keep ignoring me? Why are you always so mean to me? You're being very immature right now. Fine. If you're gonna be like that, I don't need you anyways. Todd is so much hotter anyways. Who are you? <laughs> Dang. <laughs> In that moment, I was almost certain that it had been another prank by Turner. I just knew guys like him very well. Besides, him and Andy were the only people who knew I was house-sitting alone. Oh, well, someone else knows. <gasps> the dog's barking! The dog's barking! Oh, I can't see, dude! Go outside. Where's the dog? <gasps> I saw somebody! Guys, I don't know where my flashlight is, and um, I, I for real can't see. I don't know if I was supposed to have an inventory or something. All right, let's go downstairs. I don't know where my flashlight is, and it sucks. Is there anybody outside? Hello! It was suddenly very cold outside. <gasps> this is my flashlight! I can't grab it. That jump scare made my heart hurt. Oh my goodness. I was so focused on like trying to grab the flashlight just floating in the thin air. And I'm thinking like, all right, maybe there's a circuit box somewhere or I don't know. I saw her around the corner at the last second. I peeked around. Oh, nah. Don't tell me I gotta start over. Oh, yes. Yeah. Yeah! Went over to the left side of the house. Alright. Y'all about to think I'm crazy for this. I gotta see her. I tried to grab my flashlight. I came around this corner. Oh, heck no! Let's try not going that side of the house we know she's over there what if we go over here is this it I turn the power back on yes can I see where's the dog I could tell that someone had cut the power off from outside Zeke you do not smell this it had to be Turner he was really taking me off. All right, get get inside. Get inside. What? What? You said we'd stay friends. 
Turner, this is not funny. I know it's you. Oh, I'm staying in here. Get a knife! Get a knife. Oh, oh, oh. Come on. Come on, Noah. You didn't hear that? You said we stay friends. Oh my goodness. I don't know what to do. I don't wanna go upstairs. She's definitely in the house now. She could be in any of these rooms. I had to get back to my schoolwork for Monday. Okay, all right, all right. All right. Please don't be around the corner, please. Shoot. Uh, 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 uh. This way, this way. Okay, okay. Watch the camera, watch the camera. Get on the camera immediately. Oh, she dodging the cameras? Stressful. I don't even want to turn around. I can't get off. I can't get off. I can't get off. Get on. I had a strange gut feeling about the situation. Oh my goodness. The door is open. I, it might sound stupid now, but I didn't want to overthink. This door is open. Oh my goodness. I'm freaking out. I'm freaking out. I'm freaking out. Get up! Oh, oh, oh. Can I get some instruction? Like, what do I do? I think I'm for real. I'm out of, I'm out of practice playing horror games. I gotta be out of practice. There's no way this would be that scary. I could keep working. Bro, oh. oh, get off of the, oh, he's dead. I heard something downstairs. I heard a knife. Turn the oven on. I didn't even read what it said. I think he said I didn't turn the oven on. I had to go down and check. No, you didn't. You really didn't. You really didn't have to go down and check yo i would have jumped out of the window did a roll combat roll off the roof landed on my feet and jetted there's no way there's no way yo yo wait 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 one of the knives is missing one of the knives is missing i told you to grab a knife earlier Oh, he about to get stabbed to death. Low key, it made me very uncomfortable knowing he was in the house. I had to confront him. Oh, he thinks his friend is in the house. I didn't have his contact. I could only text Andy. Can you send me Turner's contact? Ask him to quit messing. Andy, I need a text back. He's messing with what? He's been snooping around the house. This is not cool. Bro, dude, he's at my place right now. I attributed all that to a lack of my sleep. We were gonna go to the movies with Brady, but then he started pouring, so I was aware I have a tendency of being overly paranoid. He stuck with the sleepover. The only logical thing was to keep an eye on the security. Get off. Where's the stairs? Watch your corners. Now that I think about it, I should have called the cops. Well, you think? But at the time, I was so engrossed in my own thoughts, the idea never entered my head. Bro, she could be around any corner, dude. 
in any room. Wait! Wait! The back door's open! Well, we already know she's in the house. She took a knife. Get up! Oh, oh my gosh! Dude, wait, check out that article, it was Brady who told me about it. This is real sketch. This chick is walking around downstairs. She's just walking around now. My I feel my heart beat, Skipper. I froze and kept staring at the screen in pure horror. She's coming to my room! I'm at the end of this hall. Oh, shoot. She was right outside the door of the room I was in. What do you want me to do? I thought my heart would pound out of my chest. I I can't hide. Noah. Noah. Are you in there? I really missed you. Whatever is happening between us, we could work it out together. Don't play dumb with me, Noah. I know you're in there. Open the door, we just need to talk. There's nothing to talk about! I've always been nothing but nice to you. But you always treated me like garbage. I know everything. I know you left me for her. It's different with her. It, at least she's not a junkie like you. Yo, relax! This is exactly why. This is exactly why. But I love you. What about that? What about that? We deserve a second chance. You know I could turn you into the police for this. Do it and I will kill both of you. What was I even talking? If I can't have you, no one else should. What? Is he about to charge in? I got no options. I got nothing. So we know what happened. We know what happened. I know everything. Okay, so she says the same thing. At least she's not a junkie like you. But I love you. What about that? Okay. All right. Leave.
cops, though by the time they arrived, she had already left the house. But I knew where she lived. Kara was one of the first people I met on a dating site. She was three years older than me, but I found her cute, so we started dating. However, two months into our relationship, she started doing hard drugs. Dang. I tried to get her help, but she turned it around on me as if I was trying to change her. One day, I had enough, and I had to break up with her. I told her to leave and never contact me again. She was ticked. She was trying to convince one of the cops she didn't intend on doing anything wrong that night. But of course, the cop wasn't buying it. They reviewed the footage and it showed everything. From the point of her entry to the p moment she grabbed the kitchen knife. But the thing that messed with me the most was the fact that that nothing was stolen from the house. Turns out she was heavily under the influence of the drug and alcohol at the time. She was arrested and sentenced for a long time. story who who did this happen to i'm so sorry bro i'm so sorry you need to start doing background checks on on the girls you're with yo clap that up that was disgusting i don't know if i'm just out of practice with horror games i i'm not gonna lie it has been a minute that really scared me man just not knowing and she, she's in the house and then i have this thing where i'm locked on computers this this phobia started from welcome to the game thanks adam that one game where you had to be on the computer and i kept hearing things so i would have to get up off the computer but it takes so long i'm hearing stuff going on and i'm on the computer i need to be able to snap this was fierce to fathom chapter three um if y'all want to see chapter two you already know what to do be sure to sister the samurai, slice the like button, subscribe to to join the samurai. And until next time, my brothers and sisters. Sheesh. Cause my name is Kareem Kinchin.